Hello everyone, it be me, Harperman, here with a 3D Faces tutorial for Blender. Now you may be wondering, so you're gonna teach us how to make the faces? Hold on, let me just... Okay, turn around on my chair thing, which will die in a year or so. Fuck. Ugh. So you're asking yourself, you're going to teach us how to make 3D faces. Incorrect. You can, however, go to my playlist in which I compiled a fuck ton of, like, Blender tutorial bullshit. So then, and, and I know there's, like, one face making tutorial there. I might make one one day, but, uh, not today. Because today I'm going to teach you how to make your 3D faces even better if you know how to make so, let's say, hypothetically speaking, you got your face, it's all perfect and bullshit, but it, you're like... So, like, first thing you're thinking is, well, how do I get 2D eyebrows? Now, now if you're a 3D eyebrow, eye, eyebrow guy, then, um, this won't apply to you, but for those looking to do 2D eyebrows, well, let's get started. So, uh, first we're gonna control C, control V, and then put this on another layer for practice. So you got your bolstrode face, and then, uh, and then you apply your modifier bullshit. Now, how do we eyebrow, you may ask? Well, I'm glad you asked. First thing we're gonna do is get, like, uh, the face material for the paleness of the face, or whatever you do. You can do whatever. Uh, and then, we are going to get, I think, a cube. It's been a while since I did this. Uh, but I'm pretty sure I can do it. Alright, so then let's say we want these eyebrows. So then we're just going to do a bit of this and a bit of that. And we're going to scale it down and then we're just going to try and recreate the eyebrow with this cube. Hold on, let me make sure it's not too wide. Eh, it'll do... And uh, if you look down, you can see the keys and stuff, so then, you know, you can keep track of what I'm doing without you thinking, Oh my god, what fucking key is he pressing? Okay. Alright, this is looking good. go all right so there we go that's our uh, example eyebrow and then we're just gonna get a mirror modifier for it that that's our constraints mirror modifier is it mirroring okay and then of course we position it like on the face and shit So like, let's say, uh, right here, and then, you know, we just do some bullshit, and then, this is crucial, you have to make sure it digs into the face enough to where the whole entirety of the eyebrow can, like, touch the face and stuff, okay? And what we're gonna do here, like, again, you can edge split, and then just, like, I'll, I'll have to put in the time skip, but, yeah, you can smooth, and then subdivision surface. Then maybe the eyebrows might turn out better. Uh, let's just put it at three. The higher you turn the view, the most more slower Blender's gonna be. So just um, be careful about that. And also it'll make the eyebrows look different, but we don't need to worry about that. Now, uh, now conveniently, this puts us into the next part of the tutorial, how to improve baking your faces. So what we're gonna do uh, I have a plane here, so we're gonna move this plane to here, and and th and this is important if you want like sexy detailing on your face. Okay, is that eyebrow position correctly? Okay, it is. Uh, all the modifiers have been applied, so then we'll just go ahead and UV you wrap it. Uh, with these very specific settings, you might have learned from the baking tutorial. 
Okay, so we do a bit of that. Takes a bit. Oh, and then we'll go into texture mode just to view the epicness of the big. Oh, oh, another thing. Another thing I should have told you to do. And for say for more safety concerns, just add materials to the eyes to ensure they're black or something, or whatever color you want them to be. Uh, check off alpha tab new. Check off alpha again. Testing bit. And then, you know, we're just kind of setting up the way we did in the baking tutorial, which, which gets already set up. And then I'll be back with you when it finishes baking. Okay, so now the face is baked. Let's remove the eyebrows. And, oh, would you look at that? We have 2D eyebrows. Whoa. This is incredible, you might be saying. And yes, it indeed is. And then afterwards, just look at my baking tutorial for assigning textures of bullshit. So uh, now we'll just get rid of these eyebrows, and would you look at that face? You may be thinking, there's nowhere to go but down from here. Incorrect. So what we're going to do is move this thing off of here because we don't need it. And then we're going to get a plane for the mouth. Now you may be thinking, oh, but why would we need a mouth? The esophagus is already there, or whatever the fuck you call it. Well, uh, this is just to make the face better. Trust That's the whole point of this video, make, make your faces better. Okay, so then we're going to, you know, carefully position it to where, you know, it won't be cutting into the face or something like that. Alright, that's good, I guess. Then we put in black, and, you, and I'm not sure what will happen if you bake it, if you want to go ahead, but you don't need to, like, I'm pretty sure you don't need to bake the inner... It, this black plane for the face to work in trains. I am pretty certain. And, uh, yeah, that was a tutorial on how to improve your 3D faces. I may do more in the future, but this is all I got for you for now. Uh, thank you guys for watching this Blender tutorial, and I will see you with more bullshit. Trust me, videos, comment, please.